You know, when you look inside of a man's eyes, you're supposed to be able to see what's inside of a man's soul. You're supposed to be. Well, I can't promise you that I can see inside of Deontay Wilder's soul when I look into his eyes. But when I look into his eyes right now, I see a man possessed. Stay tuned. We're going to talk about this. So mean, I make medicine sick. Yes. Come on! Root to the fruit, more base than Bootsy Collins. You versus me, that's like Ali versus Foreman. God's act. Stand back and watch, devil's time out, can't be time with no swatch, watch who I am, the black Abraham, zungo zungo bang, yellow man, Vietnam, adding extra bars, I spar with little tall, taking kingdom from czars, winning more wars than the more. Now what's the deal, star? I've seen the devil spar with the law, mathematics was the key to set my whole race free, you might debate me, a refugee, no harm hurt me, now you're thirsty from the struggle till my own, hustle bubble on the low, what was me to show the free bar, right, the righteous Asiatic. Take a while, shapes her raw flight Civilized, it's like the Molly Burgundy Wally Rockin', seen the fifth when Ali clocked And John Forte, you keep Alright, alright, LDBC, this is your boy Coach Sheldon Harrison You're live, live, live on the Coach Sheldon Harrison Combat Sports Show Live Okay guys, part of this channel is a boxing channel I'm going to talk about this fight, really there wasn't a fight But I'm going to talk real fast like this So guys, maybe I have to slow the video down to understand what I'm saying Because the coach talked real fast, okay Alright, so this fight, you know, we all know that Luis Ortiz brought this guy in This 6'7 guy named Daniel Marsh to come in to be a bum Okay, to come in to be a punching bag Because Luis Ortiz wanted to figure out, you know, how, how it feels like to fight somebody who's 6'7 six, seven, six or seven tall But the thing of it is though, you know, this guy was no Deontay Wilder He couldn't be Deontay Wilder Okay, because Deontay Wilder would definitely not just stand there and get beat up like Daniel Mars did. Daniel Mars was an over-sparred, over-glorified punching bag. That's what it is. Okay, Luis Ortiz went to the body in the first round. Dropped Daniel Mars in the first round with a few body shots. Then, second round, uh, Luis Ortiz caught Daniel uh, Mars with a, uh, uh, caught him with a beautiful left hook. And then that's it. That's all she wrote. The fight was over. Okay, good. Got that out the way. Now, let's talk about the real fight. The fight that happened after the fight. This one, right here. Okay, this fight right here. All right, Deontay Wilder came in the ring, okay? And guys, I purposely, I held off, okay, on the last part of it because I'm going to actually give my reaction, okay? I'm going to give my reaction to um, what Deontay Wilder said when he came into the ring, and it was, it's kind of crazy. Let's cut the music and let's let's play, you know, what happened at the last part of the fight because I didn't want to listen to anybody else, okay? I didn't want to. I wanted to actually hear from myself the first time. So here goes. Cut the music. And let's go ahead and send it up to our very own Jordan Hardy, who is trying to stand by and look at this. Uh oh. Uh oh, what's going on, y'all? What the heck's going on here? Oh, they they they, they trash talking back and forth. Luis, congratulations on the great knockout performance. Clearly, you have some words of water. You want him next? Okay, I don't want to hear you talk. And getting in the ring now. Deontay Wilder's getting in the ring. Get in the ring. He's here. He's here. He's here. I want to fight you. You want to fight me? Oh, Luis, want to fight you. When? When, when, are you ready? when are you ready? No, I'm ready. You ready? I'm ready for you. All right, stay by the phone, baby. Stay by the phone. I've been wanting to. Stay by the phone. You messed this opportunity up. I bless you with the opportunity the first time. Yeah, yeah, you, you know, you know they happy. Bless you with the opportunity the first time. Hey, what, what he did let you do? You. Let's see. We'll opportunity. see when this comes up. Clearly, you guys are ready to fight. Deontay and Luis. Great job tonight. Ready back to you. You just shut up and hold the microphone. They are certainly ready to do battle. Yeah, he put him down. And Luis Ortiz and Deontay Wilder. Look at that. What a matchup that'll be. Here in a potentially uh. next year. He says that Joshua clearly doesn't want to fight you. He doesn't want to fight him. Let's give the world yes. this fight right. and make it happen. Joshua don't want to fight anybody. Well, Stephanie, you know, if you're ready and you say you're ready, because I was ready for the first time. I, I understand that blood pressure appears and stuff like that. No, you don't. But you, you know what? This is a new day for you. Thank God that he blessed you again. Bless you. And you know what? Because he blessed you, I'm going to bless you too. Because I do, I think you're one of the best. Yeah, and good. I wanted to prove that I am the best. So oh, for well. the best to prove that they are the best, yeah. best must fight each other. Agreed, so yeah. I'm going to bless you again with the second opportunity. Bless you with the Holy Ghost. So stay by your phone, Louis Ortiz. <laughs> stay by the phone. He said it again. <laughs> Be ready. 
I don't want no excuses. Yeah, yeah, I don't want no excuses. I don't want no excuses. He don't want no excuses. Que no hay excusa. Grita al mundo, que el mundo sabe, el mundo, Miami, el mundo entero, que tú vas a firmar la pelea para pelear tú y yo. There be no excuses. Tell the world, Miami, God included, that you're going to find the fight, take the fight, and make the fight. You gotta get popped. I'm again. always a word. Of, I'm always a man of my word. There's yes. nothing I never said that I haven't did. He's a man of his Louis Ortiz, you will yeah. have the fight. I will yeah. bless you again. And this time, no excuses. No excuses. No excuses. No excuses. Miami, he's one. Es que pelea. Vamos a ver la pelea. Miami. Okay, let's do it. Hey, make sure yeah. you train hard, cause I'm coming to whoop your ass. Deontay, <laughs> this PG-13 channel, you can't say that. Motherfucker, you bitch. All right, Luis, okay. you can't say that. I thought you didn't speak English. English. You speak it up, English. I apologize for the language that was used, but my goodness, these two gentlemen are ready to go to battle. Deontay Wilder, Luis Ortiz. Robert, I'm pumped already. Oh, I'm pumped. You see, right when he put him down, he came over here over the rope. He looked right at, he looked at, right at Deontay Wilder. He did. <laughs> Deontay, stop. He got knocked down, but this is a PG-13 channel. When you step in the ring with me, I'm going to knock your ass out, too. Oh! Deontay Wilder saying he's going to knock out Luis Ortiz. Well, this can go on all night long. We can, they will go ahead and maybe one day settle the score. Inside the ring, we'll come back and get ready for our main event. You're watching BBC on FS1. Luis Ortiz, watch the All right. Okay. <laughs> He told Luis Ortiz he gonna knock him the f out. <laughs> Everybody, I got in there, I done knocked out, and when I get you in there, I'ma knock you the f out too. Bomb squad. <laughs> oh, this fight going down. This fight going down. And I'm sorry, some of y'all got excited. So if some of y'all get mad. And, well, let them talk. Well, how about you just go to YouTube and look at the full fight for yourself, okay? Your lazy, sap sucking, yellow belly. All right, but anyway, <laughs> oh, man, I can't wait for this fight. I can't wait for this fight. This fight's going to be epic. You know what? I'm more excited about this fight than I was about Joshua. Joshua who? Joshua what? Joshua don't want to fight nobody. Joshua who? Uh, Joshua what? Joshua don't want to fight nobody that can fight back. This is your boy Coach Sheldon Handsome. What are you waiting on? Subscribe.